Security services are still poring over the so-called gold mine of information contained in the Islamic State files passed to Sky News, even as more terror attacks happen. In the thousands of files are IS registration documents for the new recruits. Others identify two training camps for hundreds of fighters. Now Sky News can reveal the existence of a suicide brigade, men who joined up to die as martyrs. The document reveals 123 names. And they come from a variety of countries. France, Germany, Spain, Tunisia and Egypt. This is one of the files. In this column, he's asked what he would like to do. The answer is simple. Suicide bomber. This is the registration form of Mohamed Belkaid. He was killed last week in the first raids in Brussels. In Syria, he is likely to have joined the Islamic State training program based in Raqqa. Sky News revealed the existence of this foreigners' training camp for fighters to attack outside Syria and Iraq. One of the, the, the things that the movements are interested in is have we got a candidate who is willing and able to carry out a suicide attack? Um, because there's a value in that. And another issue that they're interested in is, could this person, for example, operate in the West? So have they got the language skills? Are they familiar with the culture? Have they come from that particular region? Because if they have, then their ability to, to go back and operate in that same environment without getting caught uh, is much greater than, for example, sending somebody from the Middle East. What is interesting is the number of times that Belgium or Belgian cities are mentioned. We can reveal that 25 Belgians are identified in the files. There are 48 references to Belgian nationals within the registration paperwork, and there are 70 references to the country. Now, this will include sponsors, family members, and telephone numbers. Amongst the Belgians we can easily identify are Meskut Kankaturan. He came from Bruges and crossed into Syria in March 2014. He died in Syria. Another is Redwana Mohamed Hajawi from Belgium with a basic Sharia education, crossing into Syria in February 2014. He later appeared in this Islamic State propaganda video on the right here. He died near the city of Deir ez-Zor. The Sky News has learned that Islamic State recruits returning to Europe were trained not just to carry out attacks, but to be trainers as well, raising the spectre of further terror cells. The analysis of these files will take a long time, and certainly security services are gearing up for a long fight against Islamic State and its terror gangs. Stuart Ramsey, Sky News.